Welcome back to Daytime Ottawa. Next up, we're going to be talking about a great organization who works with another 60 organizations and, and more here in the, in the city of Ottawa. I am joined by Dominique Denary. She is the chair of the Ottawa Local Immigration Partnership. Dominique, welcome. Great well, to have you here. Thank you for having me, um, Tell me about um, Ottawa Local Immigration Partnership. What is its purpose? So the purpose is to bring together all the organizations that want to ensure the uh, attraction and uh, settlement and integration of immigrants in this region. So I'm in Ottawa. I've been in Ottawa most of my life. Okay. And when this came up, I said, sure, let me see where I can help. Yeah, yeah. why? Why that decision? Why did you want to? There, there's a lot of different organizations you, you, know, you yes. could have uh, volunteered for. You chose this one in particular. Because of the reach. 60 organizations. You're talking of partners from the hospitals, the colleges, universities, the Ottawa police, the, the city of Ottawa, of course, are one of our biggest uh, partner in everything that we do. But all the community associations uh, that are there to really make this a welcoming place for immigrants. And if people come here and they feel welcome, they'll stay. And all our investment in supporting people in their settlement will come back to us tenfold in terms of economic uh, integration and contribution to the city. So 12,000 uh, people come to Ottawa a year. That's a lot. Yeah, it And sure there's a combination of permanent and temporary people. We want the temporary people to find this welcoming enough and, and uh, a place they want to belong to and live and add to the vibrancy of the community, whether it's arts and uh, you talked about food earlier or anything right, else. Right, yeah, of course. Uh, of course. But also, um, we need people to, you know, the birth rate. We need folks to support our aging population. We need folks to support all our institutions, and we also need to be represented in, the, in them as well. But. I'll stop here for now. <laughs> no, no, I'm just gonna, I just got to say, you know, I, I'm I'm born in Ottawa. I've lived here, you know, my whole life, and I and I think to myself, well, of course we're welcoming. We're a welcoming city, are we? I mean, do people, the new Canadians that come here, do they feel welcome? Are, are, are there still challenges? There's still challenges. I think uh, welcome is uh, partly the attitude of people, uh, right. for sure, and that's we'll talk about the event in a minute uh, yeah. there. But it's also being able to have a job, being able to bring your kid to school. Schools that are, um, you know, where there can be some support when you come from another, another uh, uh, country that doesn't have French or English as their as their first language, and right. and it's uh, it's support, social integration, connection. You won't want to stay somewhere where you don't feel welcome. Yeah. And so it requires us to do a little bit more than just say, Sit, come, come, we need you for the jobs. Yeah, there's more effort involved than just <laughs> there's saying, a little it's more. a great city, That's just right. come. Stay right? here. <laughs> and then they say, uh, maybe not. Let me go to Toronto, Montreal. Let me go somewhere where I might feel more welcome. Right. So I think Ottawa is, one, is the sixth uh, is one of six cities that is most welcoming. So we're okay. doing good, yeah, you know, and I think we could do better for sure. Uh, Agreed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you mentioned events, uh, yes. Welcoming Ottawa Week, and yes. that's that big week of celebration. You, you've got a lot planned. Tell us about it. Yes. So uh, I have my notes in sure, case yeah, I I've got mine. You're allowed the, yours. Yeah. Okay, that's good. <laughs> um, it's. Uh, it's the 13th wow, we call you know, and okay. it's meant to be wow. So this was set up by the former mayor, and it's very much supported by the, the incumbent mayor as well, and, and council. And it is, uh, it starts on um, June 19th uh, to the 30th. So it's, it's many, many, many events. Like we're talking dozens of events, right. cultural uh, and history, but also documentary and films and it, uh, food and uh, celebration, music. It's, uh, there's challenges, but there's also immense diversity and richness. Yeah. My parents came here in 1960. Oh, yeah? <laughs> and uh, so it's, uh, it's a place where you can grow, you can have a family, have connections. But we need to facilitate facilitate that for folks who come from very, very different environments. So if people who have been here a long time, and uh, and I'm considered almost a native because it's been more than 20 years, right? it's yeah. been more than, it's been a long time <laughs> since I've been here, uh, can welcome, can participate. WOW is free. Uh, we, we're looking for events that people put on where they say it has to be about immigrants and welcoming and refugees and 
but making people feel at home, as you would welcome them into your home, right. into your communities. And so uh, people are, well, uh, are asked to provide uh, ideas and we can help, OLIP can help. So the Ottawa Local Immigration Partnership can certainly help people um, with their idea, flesh it out, you know, what okay. are we gonna do? Is it for kids? Is it, you know, is it for the full families or better? For immigrants, they prefer to bring their whole family with them. And, uh, you so know, So are what, these individuals, the are these organizations? Uh, where are you? Businesses, okay. individuals, organizations, you've got a good idea, bring it, and we can help you uh, make it happen. So right. it's been very popular every every year. Some events I attended, I didn't know were WOW events right, <laughs> until right. I oh, became, really, eh? <laughs> I took the role on. I went, oh, that was a WOW event. Okay. So I think it's up to us to make it celebratory too. We've just been through a pandemic. Yeah. And it's been rough for everyone. And there's issues uh, in terms of, uh, you know, health generally, housing. We have our big issues that we're focused on Agreed. in terms of OLIP and the organizations trying to make this a, a better place. At the same time, let's celebrate the fact that we're all here. We made it. Yeah. <laughs> we're here. No, it's a great point, you know? though. I th I'm, I'm yeah. glad you say that's kind of refreshing to hear because lately we are hearing about important issues, like you just said, affordable housing being a big one, food oh, yes. inflation. I mean, yes. it goes on and on, right? You and I yeah. could probably sit here and talk about all those yes. negative, difficult things that we need to concentrate on, but we also need to celebrate that we are a great place to come yes. to and to make people feel more and welcome. And humanize Ottawa. We're known as the f uh, city that fun forgot mm. or something. Yeah. I think we're changing that. You're changing I that with your, <laughs> with your show. But it has to be, um, no, we're human. <laughs> we want to welcome you. We support you. We need you because because we need you for not just economic reasons, but for social reasons, for connectivity, for yeah. being connected to the world, for all these uh, uh, important uh, reasons. And yeah. so let's make it uh, a week of celebration. Let's make it. it a week of connection, lasting friendships. Yeah, you know? I mean, well said, Dominique. Thank yes. you so much for joining us. Yeah, really appreciate it. I'll remind everyone at the end of the show about it.